Hey guys, thank you for joining us here. You're here with Chris and Goran, the Kick Dogs from Pig Dogs, and you're here for your free picks in this Netherlands versus Qatar matchup of uh, Group A. Uh, that's round three, Chris, in in the World Cup uh, last match of the of, of the group stage of Group A. Uh, Netherlands could get through with a draw but they will be much more comfortable with a win and they would stay at the top of that group, which theoretically gives them an easier draw in the knockouts. Yeah, I definitely, definitely would. <clears throat> Excuse me. And um, the other thing for me, though, with, with, with Netherlands, and Gordon, I don't know if you agree with me on this, is that Netherlands, what's the word, I'm, how much, I'm trying to figure out what I'm trying to say here. They're, they're a good team. But they haven't played like it. If that if that makes any sense, like it just there there's you know that there's needs, there's stuff that they can improve on. But it's good enough to get by. I don't know if it's going to be good enough to get by once we get into the knockout stages and they play your teams like you know like your Frances, your Brazils. Granted, these are all this is all speculating, assuming these teams get through. But you know your Frances, your Spains, your your your, your Brazils, your top tier teams. But the thing for me in this game is that it's good enough to get by Qatar who have been one of the worst teams and arguably the worst host country in World Cup history. The only team that didn't make it out of the the, uh, the, the group stage as a host country, obviously go back to 2010 with South Africa, but South Africa in that tournament was in the group of death. And that there, that's that there's, there's no other way to, uh, to, to sugarcoat that Qatar. They had, I wouldn't say uh, the easiest group. They haven't, they, they definitely did not, did not have a group of death quality group here. Um, and they just they they literally have not been able to, to to really cut the mustard at any any level. I think they were lucky to get a goal against Senegal. I think this is going to be a much much different result for Qatar. I think this one is all Netherlands. Um, I think this is a, a great spot where, where you see one of your you know couple blowouts that you'll have seen in the first in the group stage of the tournament. I like I'm going to go with the same game parlay for this one. You can go with Netherlands and over two and a half. Um, at uh, at minus 143 but i'm going to push this one a little bit further i'm going to go with netherlands to win to nil and over two and a half goals at plus 275 i think they win this one at least three nil maybe four nil i expect this to be an absolute bludgeoning from netherlands so that's where i'm going to go in this one yeah you know what chris uh, like you said netherlands has the quality they have the team uh they have everything they need to be much much better than they are and they have been so in convincing so far this world cup that it's quite strange thing to see because this is not a strong group, to be honest. Senegal is far from their best. Ecuador is a competitive team, but still, I think that they are weaker than Netherlands. And then you have Qatar, the team that uh, wandered into this World Cup and uh, they are already gone. So this is the opportunity for Netherlands to kind of sharpen their form to, to score two, three or more goals to kind of get into that groove. They will need it in, 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 the, in the knockouts, definitely, because uh, in the knockouts, they're going against Group B, which is England, USA, Iran and Wales. Honestly, I think England will win that group. So Netherlands wants to stay at the top of this group if they want to avoid England. And I'm pretty sure they do avoid England. <laughs> so they will either face... I don't know, Iran or, or, or USA because Wales, I don't think that's happening. But I think that Netherlands has to start using more of their chances. They have to create more because one goal a game is definitely not enough for a team like this to play at the World Cup. So I think that this is going to be the game where they will step up, where they will try to do everything they can to score two, three or potentially more goals. And I think they will because Qatar is... Just playing a simple bad team. So uh, I do like your pick as Netherlands to win 2-0 to and, and even over 3.5 or 2.5. But I will personally go with Netherlands team total over 2.5. It's actually minus 109 right now. The price has been jumping up and down for the last 10-15 minutes for some reason. But uh, I think that Netherlands can score at least three goals here easily. And I wouldn't be surprised if we see at least two Maybe even 3-0 in the first half alone, Chris. Why do I just get this vision of a price jumping up and down on your on your on the screen of your computer just when you're looking at prices? I have no idea <laughs> why. I just envision this little price, this little minus 109 jumping up and down on the screen. Um the thing is in this game is that I mean, I think I think we're both dead on here because like you said, 
would the Netherlands rather play England or Iran, USA, and Wales or Wales? I mean, it's it's apples to oranges. It's it, there's no comparison. Um, yeah, there's there's no other way to sugarcoat this. Qatar's just been brutal, and uh, like I said, I think I think this one's all Netherlands. I actually wouldn't mind that Netherlands to win to nil and over three and a half that you mentioned. I could see four nil. Uh, the plus six fifty. I think that that's a oh, great payout for it for someone definitely on the yeah, table. Yeah, definitely. That's a price that uh, if you go half a unit on it, I mean, come on, plus six fifty on that because let's be honest, Qatar has nothing to play for. Uh, they don't even have their fans to play for. So let's be honest, <laughs> they are done. <laughs> so if 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 Netherlands doesn't go all out here. I think it's going to be a mistake on their part because they need to sharpen their form. They need to become more effective in, in, in that attacking end. And uh, there's no better opportunity than this game against Qatar for that. Well, and, and let's call it what it is. If, if for whatever reason, Netherlands does have to play England in the, in the, in the round of 16, you want to be going in on the oh, best, yeah. with your best foot forward, your, in your best form. If you don't hammer Qatar... And Ecuador leapfrogs you. That is going. That's. I think that's going to set the tone for that round of 16 game. I think you'll see Netherlands come out fairly flat. So I think they have to, you know, come out here. I, I think Louis Van Hall probably going to get his, his troops rallied in this one. So that's why I, I do like Netherlands to to win to Dylan over two and a half or three and a half. Yeah. There you have it, guys. Uh, these were your free picks in this Netherlands versus Qatar matchup of Group A in the World Cup. Uh, that's on Tuesday, guys. 10 a.m. game. Uh, make sure you check out the rest of the free picks up on the Pig Dogs YouTube channel. And of course, uh, go to Pig Dogs Premium section up on the website and see what we have up there. Uh, there's always uh, some premium picks, whether you want soccer or basketball or football or whatever Chris sells. Uh, Chris does, maybe hot dog eating contest or something like that, Chris? No, I, no, I partake in, in the hot dog eating contest. <laughs> I, don't sell, I don't sell the picks on that. Yeah, you can't bet on yourself. Eh? Yeah, well, well, you can. <laughs> That's never stopped anybody. <laughs> That's it, guys. Thank you for joining us here. And, of course, uh, stay tuned for more. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the Pig Dogs YouTube channel, guys. And we'll see you soon with more free winners.